everyone! Welcome to the tutorial for this look, which is what I call the semi-formal, semi-updo, but my wife refers to as the telephone operator look. Reasons. I think this look is really perfect for maybe a summer wedding, or just a nice date perhaps. You can really dress it up with some nice little flower clips. I got these from eBay. I'm gonna say. And they come in all different colours and styles, so there are definitely some out there that you will love. You can put them here, put them here, on the side, or if you have a pretty little clip. It's actually from my wedding, so it really is a wedding hairdo. Uh, remember, if there are any looks of mine that you've seen, either on Instagram or on a video here, and you really want to see how that look is done, then just let me know and I'm happy to make a tutorial for you. Also, really great for those of you who wear hearing aids. Look at that. No rustle. So, on with the rolling. the rollers down low as we're not after body today and a smooth top looks nice. Let me know if you want a quick tutorial for this set. I'm using my favourite lot of body setting lotion for this look. As you can see, it really helps with a stiff set and shine. I'll add a link in the description for you to find it. Grab your tangle teaser and get to brushing. Next we're going to use a bristle brush to really smooth out those curls. Oh, so much brushing. Brush against your boob for super smoothness. As you brush, use your other hand to curl the ends under. Lovely. Now it's time to get really silky smooth. This is the Got To Be Oilicious Styling Spray. It's very thick, so don't use too much, especially if your hair has trouble holding it curl. Next is the Kukui Oil Hydrating Oil, which is clearly a name I am never going to be able to say. Spray it all around to get brushing with the bristle brush. Why do I use two types of oil? Well, as you will note, I don't use heat on my hair, largely because my nerve condition stops passing my skin and you have to feel hot and cold sensations until I've burnt down to the third layer, which I unfortunately know from experience. Out. Heat does, however, smooth down the heat crop, making hair glossy and beautiful. And why do we want glossy hair? Because it looks healthy and make your face feel radiant. Moving on to the front, these two rollers have been set away from the face and they look like adorable antenna. Brush through first off, then get to that comb. Smooth the outer frizz with your bristle brush. Note the lovely waves. Well, we're about to cover them up. Section off the front side like so. We're going to be creating cute little mini swirls over the top here. Almost a start of victory roll, but without looking too period or costume. For an over the top roll, i.e. one that curls under rather than over, curl your hair around the fingers on the same side of your body. I'm going to use quite large shiny pins for this so you can see what I'm doing, but I advise going for shorter mat ones. on the other side of your head, attempting to keep the twists at the same height. Right, now, depending on the event you're going to, the endurance of your hair is very important. You can leave this little front curl where it is, bouncing around, but mine tends to droop if I go out in the slightest bit of rain, no matter how strong my hairspray is, so we're going to have to do something with this. Random wife wandering in moment. Hello. Get those dark bill clips ready. We're going to be creating a lovely wave effect. Oh yes. The hair will tell you where it wants the waves to be, so go with it. Find the first depression and slide the clip through. Next one, ooh, if I don't tip myself in the face with it, goes from the front to the back. Again, allow your hair to guide you. Right. 
time to get crazy with the hairspray again. Wait for that to dry. Hopefully you haven't blinded yourself. One great trick with hairspray is to blow dry it whilst it's setting to get a really hard durable finish. Vital for a wedding. There we go, suitably solid. Wow, that's really not moving. Grab two pins. We're going to aim the first one through our first curl and into the back comb to fringe section. The rest of the fringe becomes its own adorable curl. And there we go, the telephone operator look, otherwise known as the semi-formal semi-updo. And hey look, how great is this for hearing aids? No unnecessary rustling. Oh, but do make sure you hairspray before putting in your hearing aids, because that never ends well. Remember to like, comment and subscribe for more. Hope you've enjoyed this video.